welcome or welcome back to my channel in today's video i'll be reusing these two mirrors that i purchased from the dollar tree to make four different diys y'all i'm sitting here like let me cover these mirrors up and forget that these frames actually come off so i'm going to take the other one off and then take them outside to be spray painted I'm placing one gem in between each mirror towel. I'm placing one to the center of each square mirror and once I was done with that, I removed any excess glue strings, cleaned all my mirrors off and then I had something that looked like this. I'm loving how my new wall decor turned out. It was quick, easy, and simple. But tell me what y'all think down in the comments. Okay, so now I'm going to show y'all how to take the wall decor and make it into table decor. I'm going to glue my wood blocks to my mirrors and I previously painted these with my black acrylic paint that I purchased from Michaels. You can also use the black acrylic paint from Dollar Tree as well. And once I was done with this step, I then had something that looked like this. I added more of those vase fillers on top of my mirror. They are not glued down, but I love how this turned out. It's so glam and pretty, but tell me what y'all think down in the comments. For DIY number three, I'm using my bowl to hold my mirror up and this metallic tape to go along the edges of my frames. I'm gluing a couple of these wood blocks together in sets of twos. Once I get done gluing my wood blocks down, I'm going to add some flowers and then I will be right back to show y'all the finished look. 
Look number three can be used as a flower vase, a centerpiece, or your everyday home decor. Comment down below what you would use this for. This look is actually a bonus look and all I did was put the mirrors together, added more acrylic vase fillers, pink gems, and the candle holders to the center and I think this turned out amazing. But tell me what y'all think. Please like, comment, and share. And if you're curious to see what else I can create, hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you don't miss my next video.